you so desperate for company? Oh, somehow we doubt that. It's quite a lovely sort of barrier. Then again, we suspect it's been hoisted. Here's what we propose. We have a fresh batch of three, but it isn't all fun and games. This is better news than the old queen. The ravenous brute tore down my chartreuse gown, ripped out my silken hair by its roots, wrenched my children from me, and fed me to the hogs. <gasps> An ear of corn indeed. Can you imagine a sheep in a shop? I cannot lie, I cannot lay, but only lie. Who am I? You've done it again! I'm thrilled. I'm amazed. I've a neck as long as twice the width of a toad's tail. As many eyes as half the number of seasons per annum. I'm known to cause hurricanes in the Far East merely by taking off two minutes too late. Who am I? who tried to solve that riddle puffed away in a... Sir, what would you like to know? One thing we know for certain. This barrier doesn't belong here. The wizard Maradino knew as much when he started poking around here. He developed a spell to remove it, but his fancy down the spell dropped and up we scooped it. Unfortunately, we aren't quite human enough to get it to work. But you've proven yourself just the right sort of clever, sort of intrepid sort of person we'd love to entrust such a secret to. We thought you'd never ask. What would your son call her? And she's been here. We do hope she's not entangled in anything unsavory. What a sh... Maradino had some talent mixed in with all that hot air. He certainly knew how to remove magical barriers, if nothing else. 